So what the card says doesn't change the flow that we do. It doesn't change um, the length of time that we're here. It doesn't change all of the things that you'll still experience when you're on your mat, like you do every time you come into your mat, things come up. You're faced with your life, you're faced with you, basically, as you move through your practice. So I'm gonna shuffle one more time and then pull this card right here. And it says courage. So courage is our word for the day. You can scream real loud if you want to. <laughs> but today we're gonna work with courage. And it even has an exclamation point. So like for real courage, not like, not like kind of courage, like courage. So where in your body, like imagine where in your body where your courage manifests. Maybe your courage comes from the tips of your toes. Maybe your courage comes from the pit of your belly. Maybe you have to manifest the courage from behind your mind's eye. So let's begin. Child's pose. Presence yourself. Step one, you are in this room. You are on your mat. Maybe your mat feels familiar. Maybe you were on a new mat this morning. Walk your fingers out in front further. Bring your elbows up off the earth. Tent your fingers, press them down deeply into your mat as you press the tops of your feet into your mat. Equal and opposite pressure. Fingers reaching, fingers pressing, toes pressing down into the earth. Can you press your little pinky toe even further down into the mat? Right here, begin your ujjayi breath. Yeah, fill the room with the sound of your breath in for a count of four and breath out for a count of four. And no, this is the pose that you can come back to at any time if you need to come back to your breath, if you need to come back to you, if you need to come back to your mat, to a place of quiet, to manifest or to recreate your courage for today. And it takes a lot of courage, first off, to even come to yoga, to come to your mat, to come to a place with other people where you can work towards something that's bigger than you. Creating a room full of energy, a room full of breath, maybe a room full of humidity, uncertainty. Be curious as you create your courageous self here on your mat today. Take another big breath in, audible exhale out. And during this practice, I can offer hands on assists. If you do not want to be touched for whatever reason, please raise your hand now so that I will know and honor that. Thank you. Breath in. Let it go. Downward facing dog. Spread your fingers wide. Press the top of the earth away from you, the top of your mat, the top of your earth piece that you work on. Press your sits bones towards the sky and soften your knees. Breathe in, breathe out. Again, breathe in, breathe out. Really root down through your first finger and thumb knuckle. I should not be able to pluck your fingers up off the earth. Breathe in. And breathe out. And lift your right leg. Toes point straight down. You can look back. Dial your toes straight down towards the earth. So lift from the inseam of your tights, your shorts. Breathe in. Bend your knees, stack your hips. 
downward facing dog. Lift your left leg strong and straight. Press out through your heel, press higher through your back leg than you think you can. Bend your knee, stack your hips. Downward facing dog. Walk your feet to your hands at the front of your mat. Take ragdoll pose, feet hips width distance apart. It's about two fists width. Clasp opposite elbows with opposite hands. Press your sits bones towards the sky, let your head hang heavy. Press out into my hands, press out into my hands, yeah. Down through your heels, into my hands. Sits bones to the sky. Breathe in, breathe out. Breathe in, let it go. Again. Come to stand, long straight spine, hands at heart center, eyes open, soft gaze. We'll begin with three ohms. Breathe in. Oh. Extended mountain, press down, reach up, look up. Exhale, forward fold. Halfway lift, fingers next to your toes, breathe in. Plant your hands, high plank, step or jump back. Belly button in, chin out of your chest. Hold here in your first high plank. Hips up in line with your shoulders. Pull your shoulder blades together, gaze forward. Pull your heart towards the fireplace, low plank. Untuck your toes, press them into the earth, upward facing dog, breathe in, thighs lift, knees lift, downward facing dog. <sighs> Three breaths. Muster the courage today to stay when you want to run to leave your messy hair where it is and feel your thigh burn. Feel your toes spread out on the mat. And just be aware of your body and the sensations, but no judgment, no criticism. Just be present. That takes courage. Big breath in. Empty your breath all the way out. Bend your knees, look at your thumbs, jump. Top of your mat. Halfway lift, forward fold, extended mountain, press down, reach up, breathe in. Exhale, forward fold. Halfway lift, long spine, hands to the mat, high plank to low plank. Upward facing dog, toes press down, thighs lift, knees lift, breathe in. Downward facing dog, hips high. Three breaths right here. Let it go. Press the mat away from you as you create space in your spine. Let it go. Another big breath in. Empty all the way out, bend your knees, look at your thumbs, jump. Halfway lift, forward fold, extended mountain, press down, reach up, breathe in, get big. Exhale, forward fold. Halfway lift, long spine, hands to the mat, high plank to low plank. Upward facing dog, toes press down, breathe in, downward facing dog, hips high. Three breaths. Let it go. Breathe in and breathe out. Courage. 
Courage is showing up, being present, taking ownership of your story, and being vulnerable. And sometimes being vulnerable looks like getting real with yourself. Breathe. There's nothing more real than breathing. Breathe. Bend your knees, look at your thumbs. Jump. Halfway lift. Forward fold. Last sun salutation A. Reach up, get big, look back, see something you didn't see before. Exhale, forward fold. Halfway lift, breathe in. Plant your hands on the mat and jump back to a high plank. Low plank. Upward facing dog, press down, lift up, breathe in. Downward facing dog, let it go. Right leg, strong and straight, lift it up. Flex your foot, strong, press out through your heel. Bend your knees, stack your hips. Come up onto the tippy toes of your bottom toes and flip your dog. Both feet on the ground, they face 12 o'clock. Reach your fingers towards the fireplace, press your hips towards the sky. Look up, look towards the fireplace, peel open. Side plank, right hand center of your mat. Press down, lift your hips. Press down, flex your feet. Flex, 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 yes. Look up towards your fingers where they're reaching. Take a big breath in. Downward facing dog. Courage, maybe courage shows up as being playful. Playful, maybe courage is, um, yeah, just hanging in there. Lift your left leg strong and straight. Flex that back foot. Bend your knee. Stack your hips. Come up onto the tippy toes of your bottom foot. Yeah, flip your dog. Both feet down to the earth. Face 12 o'clock. Press down through your heels. Lift your hips towards the sky. Reach up. Spin your heart towards the sky. Breathe in. Side plank, opposite side. So do what you need to do to balance yourself out. Maybe you're on the left, maybe you're on the right. It does not matter. Press down through your bottom foot to lift your top foot. Flex your top foot. See your fingers. Look up. Reach up. Downward facing dog. Ha. Breath in. Breath out. Bend your knees. Look at your thumbs. Jump. Half lift forward fold, big toes come to touch, toe heel your feet together, chair pose, squeeze in, sit deep, reach your fingers towards the sky, imagine a big ball of energy between your hands, imagine your energy is right here, press your hip creases towards the back of your mat, stretch your toes, yeah, belly button in, bottom ribs in, Lift your gaze, lift your heart, breathe in, sit two inches deeper, take a big breath in, have the courage to stay, it's okay, shaking, burning is beautiful, forward fold. Halfway lift, breathe in, high plank to low plank, upward facing dog, press down, lift up, breathe in, downward facing dog, let it go. Big breath in, big breath out. Right foot steps forward next to your right thumb. Left heel plants, warrior one. Left heel plants. Bring your back heel, yeah, down to the earth. Now stack your front knee over your front ankle. Press your knee towards your right pinky toe. Pull back on your right hip to send your left hip forward. Yeah, get long through your side body. Same big ball of energy between your hands, bright fingers. Take a breath in, look up, lift your heart, go up, go back. Exhale, hands to the mat, high plank to low plank. Upward facing dog, press down, lift up, breathe in. Downward facing dog, let it go. Left foot forward, warrior one. 
back heel plants set up your foundation be intentional with your movements be courageous with your thigh as it speaks to you sit deeper into your front thigh press your left knee towards your left pinky toe pull back on your left hip to send your right hip forward breathe in exhale look up look back take another big breath in here up at the top be courageous lift your heart lift your gaze exhale hands to the mat high plank to low plank upward facing dog press down lift up breathe in downward facing dog exhale it out breath in breath out now for our next sun salutation b series that's what you were doing you just made maybe didn't know it we will move one movement one breath bend your knees look at your thumbs jump halfway lift breathe in exhale forward fold chair pose sit deep inhale reach your fingers exhale forward fold halfway lift breathe in hands to the mat exhale low plank upward facing dog inhale breathe in yeah downward facing dog exhale it out inhale right foot forward warrior one press down ride your breath breathe 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 exhale hands to the mat high plank to low plank upward facing dog fill up downward facing dog empty left foot forward warrior one press down lift up reach up breathe in exhale hands to the mat high plank to low plank upward facing dog breathe in downward facing dog sigh it out breath in breath out maybe courage shows up as moving one movement one breath rather than holding maybe courage is not being attached to how your yoga flow looks your flow is your flow it's nobody else's bend your knees look at your thumbs spring loaded jump halfway lift exhale fold chair pose sit deep squeeze reach up breathe in exhale forward fold halfway lift breathe in plant your hands high plank to low plank upward facing dog breathe in down dog breathe out right foot forward warrior one press down lift up reach up get big exhale hands to the mat high plank to low plank up dog full breath in don't miss any bit of it down dog full breath out left foot forward warrior one press down go up go back breathe in exhale hands to the mat high plank to low plank up dog big breath in down dog big breath out again breathe in let it go right leg strong and straight bend your knees stack your hips peel open second flip dog check it out maybe it feels different because you're like oh i kind of know where we're going press down lift up reach up see your fingers see the fireplace breathe downward facing dog left leg lift it strong and straight bend stack and open flip your dog press down press your hips to the sky reach your fingers to the fireplace open up peel it open crack it open yes downward facing dog let it go big inhale <clears throat> big exhale bend your knees look at your thumbs jump top of your mat halfway lift fold chair pose squeeze sit deep bring your hands to heart center chair twist towards the chakra wall bring your left elbow to your right knee 
And then take a look down. Did your left knee creep out in front? Can you squeeze your two legs into one? Sit your hips lower than your heart. Open your wings if that's there for you. Left fingers down, right fingers reach, and sit deeper. The ferocity of a courageous lion, right? Squeeze, forward fold. Halfway lift, breathe in. Forward fold. Chair pose, sit deep, squeeze in. Woo! Yeah, hug in, skin to muscle to bone. Hands to heart, center chair, twist towards Nebraska. And say your hips lower than your heart. Same work, different side, feels different. Open your wings, squeeze in. Sit two inches deeper. Another big breath in, forward fold. Halfway lift, breathe in. Exhale, hands to the mat, high plank to low plank. Up dog, take a big breath in. Down dog, let that breath go. Yeah, right foot forward, crescent lunge. Fire up your back heel, stack it over your back toes. Maybe that takes a longer stance. Lift your hamstring towards the sky. Reach your fingers towards the sky. Squeeze your inner thighs in. Again, stack front knee over front ankle. So stack, stack your back toe. It's like a little Barbie foot. Like heel over toes. So up on your tippy toes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Press out through your heel. Lift your hamstring. Reach your fingers towards the sky. Hands to heart center, revolved crescent towards the chakra wall. Squeeze in, elbow to knee, knee to elbow. Open your wings. Twist and twist and twist. Warrior two. Back heel plants, gaze out over your front middle finger. Courage. Courage. Flip your front palm, reach up. Reach back, breathe in. Exhale, hands to the mat, high plank to low plank. Upward facing dog, press down, lift up, breathe in. Downward facing dog, let it go. Left foot forward, crescent lunge. Stack back heel over back toes. Press out through your back heel. Yeah, if your knee comes past your front ankle, take a longer stance. Squeeze. Sit deep into your front thigh. Beautiful, bright, energetic fingers shooting lasers. Hands to heart center. Revolved crescent towards Nebraska. Squeeze in. Open up. Breath. Bright fingers. Keep your fingers alive and the rest of you is alive as well. Like molasses, open up to warrior two. Back heel plants, gaze out over your front middle finger, sit deep into your front thigh. Flip your front palm, reach up, reverse, breathe in. Exhale, hands to the mat, high plank to low plank. Up dog, take a big breath in. Down dog, let that breath go. <sighs> Breathe in, side out. <sighs> Bend your knees, look at your thumbs. Jump. Halfway lift, forward fold. Come to stand, long straight spine, be intentional. Eagle, right foot. Right leg up and over your left. Press your left foot into the earth. Right thigh up and over. Set your drishti spot. Set your gaze. Find a spot that is not moving out here. Hug skin to muscle to bone. Squeeze. 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 And switch sides. And find your spot and fixate on it. Mm. 
muster the courage to wiggle, to wobble, to squeeze harder, to sit deeper. And switch sides. Maybe you explore where you left off. Maybe you pull in a little bit harder. Wrap your legs, squeeze them together. Lift your elbows up in line with your shoulders. Pull your shoulder blades together on your back. Squeeze. Squeeze. And switch sides. Left thigh up and over. Everything that's touching, squeeze it into center line. Squeeze. And come back to standing. Press your left foot strong into the mat. Bring your right knee into your chest. Set your gaze. Belly button in, bottom ribs in, get tall. Take the yogi toe lock. If you're working on that, reach down, grab your big toe with your first two fingers. Kick out through your front heel. Bent knees are fine. Open your leg out towards the chakra wall. Extend your left arm. See your left thumb. Maybe you wiggle it so you can see it. Maybe you turn your whole head so you can see it. Come back to center, leg high, fingers high, reach up, kick out, five, four, three, two, one, airplane. Back leg, right leg kicks back, strong, 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 toes point straight down. Drop your right hip two inches. Yeah, breath in, breath out. Breath in. Hands to heart center, left hand down to the earth or to a brick, set up for half moon. Stomp down through your standing leg. Yeah. Flex your back foot. Stack your hips. Peel open. Flex your back foot. Flex. Pull your, yes. Reach your bright fingers towards the sky. Lift your back foot two inches higher as you stomp down through your standing leg. Skin to muscle to bone. You're expanding from the inside out. Hug in and express out. Hug in and express out. One more big breath in. Join both feet on the earth. And come to stand. Big breath in. Make your way to the top of your mat for standing leg raise opposite side. Hug your left knee into your chest. Belly button in, bottom ribs in, drishti set. Take the yogi toe lock, grab your big toe, yeah, kick out through the sole of your foot. Open your leg towards Nebraska, extend your right arm towards the chakra wall. Pull everything in as you take up space. See your right thumb. Come back to center, foot high, fingers high, kick, five, Four, three, two, one, airplane, shoot it back. Left leg strong, back behind, arms back by your sides, palms facing the earth. Drop your left hip two inches. Breath in, breath out. Breath in, hands to heart center, half moon, right hand down to the earth, to the brick. Stack your top hip, flex your back foot, stomp down through your standing leg, stomp, flex that back foot, reach your bright fingers, pull in and send that energy out, hug in, muscle energy in, the energy you can't see, shoot it out the bottom of your foot and your fingers, take another big breath in, let it go. Slowly join both feet on the earth and come to stand. Yeah, breath in, <coughs> let it go. 
dancer pose, right side. Right foot presses down, right arm reaches high. Left hand, like it's gonna carry a tray. Grab the inside of your left foot. Yeah, open shoulder, so thumb faces, yes, beautiful. Belly button in, bottom ribs in. Kick your foot towards the sky as you pull back on your foot with your hand. The same, pulling in and pressing out. Pull in and press out. Pull in, press out. And switch sides. Left foot on the earth. Grab the inside. Yeah, you know where to go. Grab the inside of your right foot. So yeah, thumb faces up. Kick and pull. Imagine you could put your toes on the sky. Kick and pull and kick and pull. And switch sides. Right foot down. Yeah, go right into it. Soften your standing knee. Yeah, bright fingers on your right hand, lively fingers. Courage. Courage. Switch sides. Go for it. Send your power out into your fingers and your toes. Breathe. Courage. Come back to standing. Yeah, take a breath in. Let it go. In tree pose, right foot presses into the earth. Left foot, ankle, calf, or inner thigh. Press your foot into your leg, your leg into your foot, yeah, just away from your knee. Send your bent knee towards the back of the room, so press it towards the back of your mat. Equal pressure, foot into leg, leg into foot, belly button in, bottom ribs in, set your gaze. Find your spot out in front. Spread your branches when you're ready. Maybe when you're not ready, that's courage too. Lift your heart. Lift your gaze. See the ceiling right up above you. Can you see where the ceiling meets the wall in the back of the room? It's a different kind of courage. Hands back to heart center and switch sides. Left foot presses into the earth. <coughs> right foot, ankle, calf, or inner thigh. Yogi's choice. Foot into leg, leg into foot. Find your drishti spot. Press in, hug in, get tall. Press into my hand. Yeah, press down into the earth, press up into my hand, yeah. Yes. Spread your branches when you're ready. Press more up into my hand, get tall, yeah. Look up, reach up with your heart. Open up. Hands back to heart center. Join both feet on the earth. Take a breath in. Let it go. Extended mountain, press down, reach up, breathe in, get big, take up space. Exhale, forward fold. Halfway lift, breathe in. Hands to the mat, high plank to low plank. Upward facing dog, press down, lift up, breathe in. Downward facing dog, let it go. Right foot forward, warrior one. Open up to warrior two. Press front knee, yeah, towards front pinky toe. Flip your front palm, reach up, reverse, breathe in. 
extended side angle right side forearm to thigh fingers to earth keep stacking knee over ankle stack shoulder over shoulder look up underneath your armpit long line of energy from fingers to the knife's edge of your back foot spin your heart towards the sky take a big breath in let it go take another big breath in warrior two yeah straighten your front leg soft knee reach your right fingers to the front of the room reach 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 bring them down to the earth or a brick on the outside of your right ankle for triangle soften your knees reach your bright fingers up towards the ceiling lift your heart yeah spin your left lung towards the sky yeah stomp down through your left pinky toe take a big breath in let it go another big breath in come up to standing both toes face nebraska side facing wide angle forward fold hinge at the hips long spine bring your fingers down to the earth walk them back in line with your toes yeah take a longer stance than you think you can wiggle your feet out wiggle your feet out to the outer edges of your mat or somewhat close work to bring the top of your head down to the earth maybe that takes a longer stance than you think that you could do that you thought that you had already done maybe press your sits bones towards the sky soften your knees press out through the pinky toe edges of your feet and soften and soften breathe in and breathe out breathe in breathe out walk your fingers out halfway lift long spine toe your feet in a little bit press down come to stand right toes face the fireplace left foot about halfway up your mat setting up for pyramid pose so wide stance but short stance squeeze inner thighs in reach your fingers towards the sky hinge at the hips long spine reach to the fireplace reach 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 then frame your front foot with your fingers fingers can be on the earth fingers can be on blocks blocks are tools to bring the earth closer they do not mean anything use them use them you have them use them so much resistance so much resistance to blocks send your nose towards your right pinky toe soften over your front knee breathe twisting triangle left fingers stay where they are right fingers reach towards the sky take a shorter stance bring this back foot closer up and press down through your back heel yeah so this short stance so that yeah back heel on the ground press your hips towards the back of the room yeah yeah get long through your spine reach your right fingers high towards the sky squeeze keep pressing down through your back heel keep your hips neutral yeah yeah breathe 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 and twist 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 take another big breath in keep pressing down through your back heel yeah take another big breath in exhale hands to the mat high plank to low plank upward facing dog press down lift up breathe in downward facing dog let it go left side warrior one courage courage lift up reach up breathe in open up to warrior two so toes face 12 o'clock warrior two yeah stack front knee over front ankle press knee towards pinky toe bend deep into that front thigh warrior two gaze out over your front middle finger flip your front palm reach up reverse breathe in extended side angle forearm to thigh or fingers to the earth inside your left ankle yeah extended side angle yeah yeah bricks are great 
bricks are awesome. Press out through the knife's edge of your back foot. Left lung under, right lung towards the sky, bright fingers. Keep pressing knee towards pinky toe, out towards the, toward, yes. Take a breath in, let it go. And take another big breath in. Now here's the magic, stay low in your front thigh, warrior two. You got this, stomp down through your front heel, warrior two. Yeah, you got it, you got it, you got it. Straighten your front leg, soften your knee. Set up for triangle, left side. Reach your fingers towards the fireplace. Get long. Bring your fingertips down to the brick on the outside of your left ankle. Again, stack your shoulders. Press out through the, yeah, pinky toe edge, bright fingers, yeah. Big breath in, big breath out. Big breath in. Courage, another big breath in, come up to standing, right fingers bring you up, pivot both toes to face the chakra wall, side facing wide angle forward fold, second set, hinge at the hips, get long through your spine, yeah, plenty of space, work to bring the top of your head down to something to the mat, to a brick, to a couple of bricks. Get out of your head and into the brick. Get out of your head by getting your butt up over your head and your head into something else. That physical contact transfers the concentration, it transfers the story, it transfers everything. It makes your brain go, whoa, what just happened? Soften your knees and come into you. Feel your feet, feel your fingers. Walk your fingers out in front, long spine. Press down, come to stand. Maybe toe heel your feet in a little bit. Whatever you need to do to come up to standing. Left toes face the fireplace. Spin around on your left heel. Point your toes towards the fireplace. Right foot, yeah, set up for pyramid. Short stance, wide stance, yeah. Root down through your back heel. Take a wider stance with your back foot. Work it out, yeah, 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 yeah. Now press down through your heel. Press down through both heels. Imagine your hips are like headlights. Face them towards the fireplace. Squeeze inner thighs in. Reach your fingers high towards the sky. Belly button in, bottom ribs in. Hinge, reach forward. Long spine, reach, 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 reach. Frame your front foot with your hands. Place your fingers on bricks. Soft knees. Send your nose towards your pinky toe. I love bricks. Bricks are the bomb. Breathe in. Soften over your left knee. Breathe in and soften. Breathe in and soften. Twisting triangle, right fingers stay right where they are. Pull the top of your head towards the fireplace. Get long through your spine, yeah. Reach your fingers towards the ceiling. Spin your heart towards Nebraska, breathe. Keep squeezing inner thighs in, bright fingers. Breathe, breathe in. Twist, 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 twist. Breathe in, let that breath go, you've got this. Breathe in, exhale, hands to the mat, high plank. Excellent work, yogis, low plank. Upward facing dog, press down, lift up, breathe in. Downward facing dog, let it go. Breathe in and empty out. <sighs> Spread your fingers wide, root down first finger and thumb knuckle. Shift your weight forward to a high plank. Low plank, high plank, low plank. 
high plank, low plank, back up to high, lower down five, chin out of your chest, three, two, one. Bring an ear to the earth, bring your arms back by your sides, palms facing the mat. Yeah. Spin an ear, yeah, down. Take a breath in. Soften, let it go. We are here, we are ready for locust pose. Zip your two legs into one. On your next breath in, fly. Hands, heart, feet, lift up, rise up. Let your breath go. Lift up, breathe in, flex your feet. Ooh, what's that feel like? Breath in, breath out. One more, breathe in, flex and press out through your heels, lower all the way down. Big breath in, big breath out. Locust pose, second set, rise up, fly, hands, heart, feet, strength of your back body, this is all you. Yeah, flex your feet, what does that feel like? Flex. Take a big breath in, let that breath go. Take another big breath in, lift your heart, soften your forehead, lower all the way down. Breathe in and breathe out. Floor bow. Bend your knees, grab your feet, grab your ankles. Squeeze your knees in towards the center of your mat so they're hips width distance apart. Yeah, flex your feet. Kick your feet into your hands, pull back on your feet with your hands. Flex your feet. <laughs> Press your thighs into the earth, lift your heart, keep grabbing, keep lifting, soft forehead. Breathe in, press down through your thighs, press down through your pubic bone, breathe in, let it go. One more big breath in, press down, lift up, lower all the way down. Windshield wiper your legs from side to side. Big breath in, yeah, empty it out. And floor bow, second set. Grab your feet, grab your ankles. Squeeze in towards the center of your mat, so squeeze into me, squeeze, 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 squeeze. Flex your feet, flex your feet, yeah. Press thighs down, squeeze in, lift up, squeeze, squeeze, yeah. Soften your forehead, breathe. Another big breath in, squeeze, press down. Another big breath in, squeeze, press down, release. Windshield wiper your legs from side to side. Good work, yogis, good work. Extend your legs out long on the mat. Bring your hands on either sides of your lower ribs on your mat. So if palms face the earth, find your lower ribs with your thumbs. Yes. Yes, yes. Squeeze your elbows in towards the center. Shoulder blades in. Feet extended long, yeah. Upward facing dog. Press down through toes. Straighten your arms. Press straight down. Thighs lift, knees lift. Lift your heart. Downward facing dog. Come down to your knees and set up for camel pose. So in camel pose, your toes can be tucked or untucked. Belly button in, bottom ribs in, hands to the small of your back. Walk your shoulder blades together. Lift your heart towards the sky. Belly button in, bottom ribs in, hips forward. Set it up. Long, steady breath. Lift your heart. Maybe you reach back and grab a heel. You've got one heel. Yeah, press your hips towards the front of the room. Press, lift your heart. Keep pressing into my hands. Breathe in. And breathe out. Soften your throat. Soften your forehead. Come out of camel as slowly as you went into it. Sit back on your heels. Take a big breath in. Let it go. And camel, second set. Toes tucked or untucked. 
belly button in, bottom ribs in, lift your heart, trust yourself, courage to lean back into where you cannot see, maybe you grab a heel, lift your heart, press your hips forward, slowly come out of camel, sit back on your heels, take a big breath in, let it go. And come to lie on your back and set up for bridge pose. So knees are bent, heels just where you can touch them with your middle fingers. Feet and knees, hips width distance apart. So take the brick, if you've got a brick close by, squeeze the brick in between your knees. Yeah. So step one, lie all the way back on your mat. Can you touch your heels with your middle fingers? Lie all the way down. Yeah. So feet and knees, hips width distance apart. So bring your feet in. Like, like, squeeze. Yes, like that. Now, yes. Arms straight up towards the sky. Straight up towards the sky. Pull your shoulder blades down into the mat. Bring your elbows down by your ribs. Press your triceps down into the earth. Press your elbows down into the earth. Lift your hips. This is bridge. You can stay here. You can clasp your hands underneath the small of your back. Walk your shoulders underneath you for a further heart opener if you would like. Breathe. Keep pressing your hips towards the sky. It's like your chest is chasing your chin and you don't let it. Press the back of your head into the earth. Keep pressing your hips to the sky, heels into the earth. Four, three, two, one. Lower down with control. Big breath in. Let it go. And again, bridge. If you're taking full wheel, bring your hands on either sides of your ears. And press down to lift up. This is your Saturday. This is your practice. Take a pose, pick a pose, and go. Five, four, three, two, one. Lower down with control. Breath in. Breath out. And again, yogis, rise up. Number three, bridge or wheel. Your Saturday, your body, your courage, your power, rise up. Five, four, three, two, one. Lower down. One breath in. One breath out. Before the story can creep in, rise up. Bridge or wheel. Get it, yogis. Right here. Get it. Five, four, three, two, one, lower down, breathe in, breathe out, and last one, rise up, bridge or wheel, did that change it for you, that's a story, rise up, send your energy out into the room, fire it up, whatever that looks like right here, maybe you lift a leg and bridge, Maybe you lift a leg and wheel. Maybe you lift the other leg. You are here, this is the last one. Expand out. Lower all the way down. Take Supta Baddha Konasana. Yes, set the brick off to the side. Bring the soles of your feet together. Let your knees spread wide. One hand to your heart, one hand to your belly. And check in. Feel your energy, feel your heartbeat. Feel the sweat that you've created, that you've cultivated, your power that you've shifted around, the courage that you've found or created or invented. It's right here. It's right here. Taking a full body stretch. Reach your fingers, reach your toes. 
If you find a toe, shake it. Shake it, say hi. We're all friends here. Extend both legs high up towards the sky. Flex your feet, press up through your heels. Clasp your hands at the nape of your neck. Flex up. <coughs> Lower your legs down 30 degrees. Then another 30. Two inches up off the earth. Lift your shoulders up off the earth. See your toes, scissor kicks, any direction. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Shoulders down, legs up. Lower down 30, then 60, then two inches. See your toes and kick. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Legs back up, shoulders down. 30, 60, two inches. Flex your feet, kick. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Legs back up, shoulders down. 30, 60, two inches. See your beautiful toes and kick. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Legs back up. Pull your knees into your chest, shoulders down on the mat. Take a breath in. Yeah, let it go. Lift both <laughs> legs high towards the sky. Flex your feet. Clasp your hands at the nape of your neck. Lower your right leg down halfway, 45 degrees. Flex that foot. Yeah, press out through that heel. Lift your shoulders up off the earth and pulse towards your left pinky toe. 40, 39, 38, 37, 36, 35, 34, 33, 32, 31, 30, 29, 28, 27, 26, 25, 24, 23, 22, 21, 20, 19, 18, 17, 16, 15, 14, 13, oh yeah, 10, 7, 5, 3, one, knees in, both legs high, flex your feet, we got to get the other side, yeah, lower your opposite leg, left leg halfway down, press out through the heel, clasp your hands at the nape of your neck, lift your shoulders up, pulse towards your right pinky toe, 40, 39, 38, 37, 36, 35, 34, 33, 32, 31, 30, you can do this, 25, 24, 23, 22, 21, 20, 19, 18, 17, 16. It's about the burn. It's about the story. Let it go. Feel the burn. Feel the burn. Feel the burn. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Yeah, pull your knees into your chest. You did the thing. You did the thing. It's okay if you want me to die in a fire. It's okay. It's okay. I get it. It's okay. Breathe. It's okay. Stack your knees over your hips. Flex your feet. It's like you're in a chair, but you're not in a chair. Yeah, flex your feet. Knees over hips. Yeah. Press your palms into your thighs. Palms into your thighs. Flex your feet. Flex your feet. Resist. <laughs> Resist, press your thighs back into your hands. Resist, 20, 19, 18, 17, 16, 15, 14, 13, 12. You can see it's all you. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Pull your knees into your chest. Breathe in, let it go. Maybe you rock from side to side. Maybe you take a happy baby. Whatever feels good for you right here. <laughs> That's a story. I missed past the brick, Jennifer. You missed past the brick? Do you want no. past the brick? No. <laughs> you, you prefer it. past the brick. <laughs> I, I see. That's a good story. That's okay. Oh. That's okay. Downward facing dog. <laughs> Move around, yeah, wag your tail. What's your dog feel like after all that core work? Yeah. Extend your right leg, strong and straight. Bend your knees, stack your hips. Half pigeon, bring your right knee to your right wrist. Right knee to right wrist. Work to keep your front foot active. So press out through the knife's edge of your right foot. Stack your toe bones. Stack your toe bones and press, yeah, press out through that knife's edge. Keep your back toe tucked. 
So super active legs in this half pigeon. Yeah. When you're ready, you can crawl your fingers forward, bring your forehead down to the brick. Maybe put a brick underneath your back hip. It needs like that right there. That might help. Yeah. Yeah, walk this leg in towards the center. Yeah, yeah, so your hips are squaring. Yeah. And now you soften. Now that you've reached sleeping half pigeon, soften. And sometimes it takes courage to soften. Sometimes it takes courage to do the things that we know are good for us. Sometimes it takes courage to make time for you. Make time for you to get quiet, to get sweaty, to get centered, to get grounded. Whatever it is, it often takes a lot of courage to make time for ourselves, to make time for you. You are worth it. It is important to make time for you. Downward facing dog. Lift your left leg strong and straight. Press out through your heel. Bend your knees, stack your hips. Set up for half pigeon on the other side. Left knee to left wrist. Left knee to left wrist. Work to stack your front toe bones. Keep your back toe tucked. Active legs. And then take sleeping pigeon once you're ready. Bring your fingertips back up onto your mat. Tuck your back toes, three-legged dog with your left leg high to downward facing dog. Come down to your knees and set up for an inversion practice of your choosing. Maybe that's just waterfall pose with your brick underneath your sacrum and legs up towards the sky. If you're working on traditional headstand, we have plenty of wall space. If you're trying it in the center of your mat, try it at the back of your mat so that if you roll out, you've got plenty of space to roll out. But anything that gets your hips up and over your heart. Inversion, so it could just be the waterfall if you've ever done, I can walk you through traditional headstand if you're curious. You can take your mat to the wall like what Danielle is doing and Dorothy is doing. Yeah? Yeah. Yeah. So you're going to, you are going to make a basket with your hands, bring your pinky inside, and this is all shoulders, okay? So you're gonna press everything you've got down into the earth. You're gonna press your pinky edge into the mat, and you're gonna imagine that the skin is going this way. So you're like isometrically pressing into the earth, but you're pulling, 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 pulling. Come into down dog legs. You're gonna put the absolute top of your head, not to, like here, on the earth. 
right? Yeah. Walk in, press your thumbs into your head, your head into your thumbs, belly button in, bottom ribs in, press down through elbows. Yeah, yeah, squeeze my fist, flex your feet. Press your tailbone towards the ceiling, down through elbows. Can you bring your boot? Yeah, 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 yeah. Press up through your heels, belly button in, bottom ribs in, press out through your heels. Yeah, squeeze. Belly button in, bottom ribs in, squeeze. Down through elbows, it's 80% uh, forearms and elbows, like 10% head, if that. Press up through your heels, breathe, breathe, breathe. Breathe, breathe. 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 You can. When you're ready to come down, control. Bend your knees. Control, control, control. Pull your knees into your chest. Control, control, control. Yes. Child's pose. You can do this. So you're going to make a basket with your hands, right? Just like this. Press, press. Like this, right? Right? Press, 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 press. Everything's pressing, right? Come into down dog legs. You're going to put this part of your head on the earth right here. Down dog legs. Down dog, yeah. Down dog, hips high. Down dog legs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Walk your toes in. Walk in, walk in, walk in. Walk in, walk in. Press down through elbows. Press down through forearms. Yeah, keep coming, keep coming. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Lift one leg. Press into my hand. Press down into my hand to lift the other leg. Press, 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 press. Toes to the wall. You got it. Press up through your heels. You got it. You got it. Squeeze, 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 flex your feet. Squeeze, 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 squeeze. Belly button in, bottom ribs in. Squeeze, 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 squeeze. Flex your feet. Press up through your heels. Flex your feet. The other flex. The other flex, yeah. Yeah, yeah, You ready to come down? Just bend your knees. Child's pose. Double high five. Child's pose. Breathe, y'all, breathe. Make your way onto your backs. Make any last final movements. Maybe a supine twist, maybe a happy baby, whatever's calling. And then when you're ready, yeah, legs wide, set up for Shavasana, arms down by your sides. Find the corners of your mat with your heels. Get big, take up space. Yeah, feet flop wide, arms down by your sides, palms up to receive, yeah. Let your eyes close. Let your tongue fall away from the roof of your mouth. Let your breath do what your breath does. You have reached the final pose of your practice. And sometimes Shavasana takes courage to be, to just be. To soften all the things.
your fingers and toes. Take the biggest breath you've taken in all day right here. Fill up, fill up, fill up. Open your mouth, stick out your tongue, lion's breath out. Again, breathe in. Courageous lions out. Again, breathe in. Make some noise. <sighs> Bend your knees. Roll to your favorite side. Cradle your head in your arms. Take a little fetal position. Courage is sometimes allowing this practice to do the work, giving ourselves permission to fully experience fetal position, all of the other positions in between, to fully experience life. Right here, make a list of three things that you are grateful for. and give special thanks to someone who has inspired you this week. Slowly press yourself up to seated, the top of your mat with hands at heart center and eyes closed. Sit tall, press your thumbs into your breastbone. Thank yourself for coming to your mat, for doing this work for being present and courageous and curious. We'll close with three ohms. Breathe in. Oh. knuckles to your forehead center and together we bow and say namaste namaste give yourself a big hand that was some good work y'all